In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a Google Forms questionnaire slash survey. So in Google Forms, you can create a survey or a questionnaire with multiple answers. And I'm going to show you how you can do that in this video. So first I will go to Google and then just simply search for Google Forms. There are other ways you can get to it, but I just go ahead and search Google Forms. And it's usually the first one. Once you've got to Google Forms, you'll then see you can start a new form up here. Now you can create from a blank document or you can use a template if you want to. I recommend you just go ahead and create one from blank. It's going to be much easier. You've also got your recent forms down here. So if you've made a form and you want to go back to it, then it will be down here. So we're going to create one from blank. So click on start a new form from blank. That will then open this window and we can now start to create a form. So maybe we want to give it a title first. So I'll call it questionnaire. You can enter a form description as well. I'm going to put for YouTube video. So now we can start to add questions. Now you can do a lot of different things here where you can make questions required. You can make specific questions optional and I'll show you how you can do this, right? So by default, you're going to have one basic question appear and here you can ask a question. So maybe I want to put first gender and for a gender question, it's probably going to be multiple choice, right? So I'm going to put option one male and then option two female, right? Because there are two genders. Now, once you've added your options and you can add other options here. So if I put other, once you've got all of your options, you can choose whether you want this question to be required. So by default, it's going to be on and I will keep it on as well because it just means people don't skip through your form really quickly. Now, what we're going to do is add another question. So go add question. And maybe this time we want to capture their email. So if you go ahead and go short answer, maybe you can now ask for their email, then add one more by clicking on this plus icon. And you could create here more questions and you can change. Do you want your questions to have a short answer, a paragraph answer, check boxes, drop down and so on. Let's say long paragraph. And here I might want to write explain your process in detail. I don't know. You would have questions obviously ready to go. And that's going to be a paragraph answer. Now you might have by default a question here, which is asking for email, which you can't move or you can't delete. If that's the case, you just want to go to settings go to defaults, form defaults, and it's going to be here where it says collect email addresses by default. Go ahead and change it to do not collect or respond to input. If you do want to collect emails, you can see, look, now it's defaulted to asking for their email. So we don't need this question here down here. So this might be more of what it looks like for you when you first create a form. But once you have asked all of your questions here, you can then go up to customize theme in the top right and you can change the text style. You add a header image and change the color. If you wanted to see responses of your questionnaire, you just go to responses and they'll all be here and to send your questionnaire or survey to people, you want to click on send in the top right hand corner, then you can send via email or you can click on this link button and get a link to your survey. You can make this a shortened URL so it's easier to copy. And now if someone goes to this link, it's going to take them to our questionnaire or survey and it's going to look something like this. I'm browsing from Thailand, so it's converted it to Thai for some reason. But that's how you can create a Google form questionnaire.